Live in Times Square, this is GMA. we got to talk about a problem that, like it or not, hits so many of us. Acne, the word none of us want to say. One teen, though, went viral with her affordable solution using just four over-the-counter products to completely transform her skin. Here's ABC's Kana Whitworth. Karina Van Willow spent three years trying to beat her breakouts. It was under my eyebrows, under my under my nose, like around my lips. She saw four dermatologists, tried countless expensive topical creams, face washes, and prescription medications with no luck. When you see her going through that, people making fun of her, it hurts you. I would take her everywhere just to try to find something for her. Fed up, the 17-year-old high school senior scoured the internet for answers and created her own acne concoction using four products all under 10 bucks all from Target. After three months she went from this to blemish free. Hey guys I'm doing a skincare routine video today because a lot of you guys really wanted me to and it takes about 10 to 15 minutes to complete. She cleans her pores with Thayer's Rose Petal with Witch Hazel then washes her face with Dr. Bonner's cleanser, applies an oil-free moisturizer and a leaf from an aloe vera plant for scarring. Aloe vera is used for basically everything. It helps your acne. It helps the, like, the redness. She posted her miracle zit blaster on social media and became an internet sensation. Her photos racked up over 160,000 likes. My phone was just blowing up nonstop, and it still does. Like, I have to, like, mute Twitter. I'm happy that it's not that expensive, that you don't have to go through, you know, hundreds of dollars of going to the dermatologist when you can find something at Target for $40. Karina is now six months into a clearer complexion and more confident than ever. I don't even complain when I have a pimple anymore because before, I would, I would, when I would get a pimple, I'd get like 100 all over my face. For Good Morning America, Kana Whitworth, ABC News, Los Angeles. All right, she looks amazing. Let's bring in dermatologist Dr. Whitney Bowe. Let's talk about the causes of acne. Well, first of all, you know, what doesn't cause acne, right? Let's debunk some of those myths. So acne is not caused by dirty skin mm. or poor hygiene. And acne is not contagious. You can't catch acne from someone else. What does cause acne? You know, acne is what's considered multifactorial, meaning there are a number of different factors at play, including things like genetics, diet, stress, Hormones, skincare, you know, all of those things play a role. I liked one of the things that uh, Karina talked about in the story that she changed her, her pillowcase a lot, that she whittled this down to just a handful of products, simple, she said. Right. That worked for her. You're saying it's not a one size fits all solution. Though. It doesn't. What works for one person may not work for someone else. For example, if a young woman comes to see me and she has what are called cysts, those are those deep, sometimes painful lesions along the lower face, you know, I may talk to her about going on a hormonal treatment and I may talk to her about reducing stress in her life. Whereas if a teenage boy comes to see me and he has blackheads along what's called the T-zone, you know, I may put him on a Retin-A and ask him what's in his protein powder because that ingredient may be making his acne worse. So you know, it's really about taking a, a customized, a personalized approach to that particular person that's going to be successful. Karina went viral probably because she used products that are approachable. You don't have to spend hundreds and hundreds of dollars on products. You're saying these Absolutely things you can find in a drugstore. Yeah, so if you're going if you want to try to treat your acne without seeing a dermatologist over the counter, these are the three things to keep in mind. Okay. So cleansing, moisturizing, and retinoids. Those are the three things. When it comes to a cleanser, you want a gentle cleanser. So a simple bar of Dove soap or CeraVe. These are great drugstore brands. They don't dry out the skin. If you over cleanse and over scrub, then the skin tries to actually protect itself by pumping out more oil. So you can make things worse. But moisturizing is just as important as cleansing, even if you have oily skin because it helps to balance out the oils in the skin. So I love this product by La Roche-Posay. Again, you can get it at any drugstore. Doesn't clog the pores. But last, here, this is really the workhorse, the retinoids. So retinoids, that's something I prescribe in the office, but you can get really effective retinoids over the counter. These are really powerful when it comes to clearing up acne. Different, any drugstore has it. What I love about the Dermalogica product over there is you see it comes with two tubes. One is a buffer cream and one is a retinol. So you can actually mix them together and apply them on your skin. And that helps to ease your skin, adapt your skin into the retinoid without giving you all the side effects that some people experience. When do you know quickly that it's time to see a doctor? It's not working at home. If your acne is affecting your self-esteem and your confidence, 
make the appointment. No dermatologist is going to judge you for coming in with one or two lesions. It can cause emotional and psychological scars. And we're not just talking about teenagers. This affects everybody. We've got a lot more coming up. Thank you. She'll be answering all of your questions on Facebook.